<lacht> Für den Ignen. Right, we are very late starting this evening. Oh, let's get my chat open. Right, there we are. So I can see from Sloth, so good evening Sloth. Uh, I did see some of you in chat earlier, but I think some of you have left. Uh, so Sloth, if you're still there, good evening. Uh, Insani, and uh, Cypher, and Hugh, and Stormy. Oh my god, that artwork. That is art. That was art. Right? I think that was art. I think that was a funny moment. I enjoyed it. Now, this evening, we don't have a ship hunting crew, so therefore, we can't really do what we normally do. Now, throughout the stream, I am going to hunt for a few Sentinel ships, but it's going to be nothing like the normal streams, as no one's available this evening. Um, however, I wanted to set a little challenge. If anybody was up for it, if anybody's on No Man's Sky this evening uh, and you want some, something a little bit different to do, uh, I'd like to see how many of you are creative. How many of you have got an inner artist? Now, if you saw the intro, you may have seen that silly little face. And if you watched the stream the other day, you may have witnessed myself making that silly little face. So, I was wondering if anybody, for the duration of the stream, so before we get going, wanted to, on the, everybody on the same planet, make something as quick as they can, whether it would be with Earth sculpting, or whether you put a little base computer down and make something really, so just make something, not a base, we're not looking for a base, we're looking for a piece of art. Who can create a piece of art? And then at the end of the stream, we can go and have a look what people create. Now obviously I'll kind of blind, like head start check them before I will go live on the stream with them, like I kind of, just to make sure they're not rude or anything. But I'd like to see if anyone can create a piece of art in the time it takes me to do this stream. Now what we need to do for that is to be everyone to be doing it on the same planet so there's no portal jumping like everyone heads the same place in euclid and then creates their piece of art now it might be worth i don't know putting a little base computer down just to make sure that when i arrive i see the terrain edits whether that makes a difference i don't actually know we never tried this before i just thought it'd be fun just to see if any of you have got any creative inner artist that you can just create something from sculpting Maybe add a few little bits and pieces to it, like I did, just to make some silly eyes. But that was it. It was a mess about, but I just wondered. Just wondered. We've got loads of base builders. So he's going to hit me then. But do we have any artists? Where's Vicky when you need it? Exactly. Now, does anybody have a place in Euclid that's got no flora and fauna that is a good candidate for a spot? For everyone to jump on, whoever wanted to build anything or make anything while we're doing this stream. And then I can go back there at the end of the stream and see what you've done. I was thinking maybe LA Meat, because it's not really a ship meat place, and it is in Euclid, and we know it's flat. So if no one else has got one, we can use LA Meat, and I can put the details. In fact, let me get to my sentinel ship. I'm still at the same spot from this ship last night. This is the last ship we found yesterday. What was the slots on this one? Oh yeah, the three in a row one. This was yesterday's last ship. Right, anyway, let's get back so I can get to a teleporter and see options. I think actually LA Meat might be a quick and easy option as it was never really used as ship meat place fully. Nothing was really built there. And of course, if anyone can make something cool and creative and it's not rude, maybe we can make a little short, a couple of funny shorts out of whatever you make. Or if it's a serious piece of art, of course, make a little short about your art. So yeah, any artists out there. I mean, who, before we even go too far into this, who would be interested in making something? 
no matter how basic, when I ask you to build a tower, a castle, just a piece of art, something that you would call a piece of art, and then let's see if the stream agrees. Is it art? So if you're interested in messing around and doing something like that, put one in the chat. Let's see if anyone would even want to do something like that. Put one in the chat if you want to mess around and see if you've got any art inside of you. So it'd be like a hunt or next that ship me. At the end of the stream, I can come and have a look at it. And then the chat can say art or not art. Or judge your art. set a timer so once we're in I've given out the details we'll set a timer for when I come back and you know how long you've got to get here and build so this would be the system we'll use it is in Euclid now obviously what I would recommend is not doing it on a raised platform because you'll limit how much you can build so I do recommend starting from ground level and as you can see no flora no fauna it's actually it's gonna have a proper look down here It'd be easy for me to come back and get access to. Now, <clears throat> it don't matter if you actually build that close to each other. Because it's only terrain edits. Like build your art near each other. Depends who gets there first. You see other players maybe build not right on top of them, not too close, but close enough so we can just go from artist to artist quite easily. So yeah, I mean anywhere on the flat surface. There's nothing to get in your way. And the sky is quite literally your limit. So how many people are in? Just three. Just three of you, is that it? Three people want to take part. Wow. Yeah, we're, not, we're not talking about like with boxes. We're talking about potentially using your terrain manipulator. You know, create some art. Create something amazing. What you think is art. You know? And if you put a base computer down near it, or hide it, maybe you can add a few lights to it. Give it a bit of ambience. You know, I don't know. We're not talking about buildings. We're not talking about building anything like a base. Just terrain edits can create your art. More people are joining, say it again. Right, so who would be interested in a little challenge while I do my stream to come to this location and create a piece of art? However you see fit. Terrain edits, maybe add a few little base items to add to it, add some color. Imagination, eyes, I don't know. To see what people can create and call art. I definitely think a base computer would actually work better. So then as you like build it, you can upload. And hopefully the terrain edits will upload as part of your base because it's in your perimeter. But then at the end of the stream, before we finish, I'll just come back and have a look. And see what people have built. And the chat can say whether they think it's art or not art. If there's three people, we'll see what they're up to. Three people, that's good. So if you three that want to do it, do it. If you will try and build near each other, that'd be cool. But obviously give each other plenty of space. So your artistic blood flow. So the details is here. Let me get my stream deck open. Right, there we go. It's Euclid. You don't have to build near each other, but it just... Uh, could be good for convenience if anyone finds a good plot of land. Like I say, build lower level. What can you come up with? It's 
So that is the glyphs. It's Euclid. Come here. Before I finish the stream. Oh, wrong one. Don't want that on. That's in the way. Right, there we go. So yeah, but before I finish the stream, I'll come back to the location and see who's built anything and see what you've built. Show it to the stream and let's see if what you've built is art. I don't know, build a giant robot. Giant woman. <laughs> Banana. Whatever you think is art. Not many people really use a terrain edit tool. Use it like a paintbrush. I'll put the details at the bottom of the screen for a moment. So if you are interested, just come here. And I'd say two hours from now. From this point. So say half past 12 my time. So it's 10.30 10 my time. Half past 12. I'll come back. And see if anyone's actually built anything. And if you put a base computer down, I'll be able to find you easier. To make sure you upload it. Which means you probably have to put 10 base parts down. So maybe implement at least 10 base parts. Whether it be decorative. Whatever. Lighting. Into it. And then upload it. So. Brockton. Storming. Marcus. Anyone else that might be lurking. And like. As you know. Like old guy drifter type of viewers. That maybe like. I can build something. He's very creative. Old guy drifter would be very good at this. Very good at this. <clears throat> but we'll see. Let's see if anyone's up for the challenge. Two hours from now. 12.30, I'll return to this location in Euclid. Right. So, small challenge for the early birds. Like I say, if any of you make anything amazing, we'll make a little short out of it. Give you some credit. It was obviously rude or obscene. We won't be showing it. Sadly. Right. So. Do we sort we can find this evening? Uh, what do we want? Red Ripper. There you are. The early bird challenge, we'll call that. I mean, from here, that looks like a dinosaur spitting something out of its mouth, attacking something that's not there in the sky. Yeah. Art is what you make of it. Do your job. What's the job? Right, how many's in the chat? Thirty, so probably at least fifteen to twenty lurkers. We might have enough. We might have enough to get a quick start on this. So you all know what to do. Don't put it in the chat yet. Once I get to the portal, so preempt your number in your head. Preempt your number in your head and get ready to put it in when I ask. Once we arrive at the portal, a number from each of you, a number between 1 and 16, and I'll put them in the order the chat and supply them. But once I get there, so they don't get flushed away, we just get a nice row of numbers. traffic wardens around right then so where we go why is this song feel like it's on a loop right now 
Was this sung on a loop? Or did it just fade out and come back in? Hmm. Someone listen out for that, please. Right, so numbers between 1 and 16. One number each. Right, Q comes in first. Let me use my mouse. It'll be a lot easier. And a lot faster. Right, so we've got number... Five from Q first. Uh, number nine from Stormin. Number eleven from Hugh. Anton, good evening. Number thirteen. Prism, number twelve. And Sunny, number four. Marcus, number seven. A W, number eight. Martin at number 13. Let's double check then. Cypher number 15. Franklin number 10. Chris number 6. There we are. Good evening to you all. That's how it should be done. In and out. That's not what she said. Sounds like a fun job then, boss. <coughs> Put your feet up, mate. Enjoy. Right, first things first. Bomb bomb. Right. Let's see that song plays again. It goes dun. Dun dun dun. Wait, there's a pause. Silence in the storm. Should we be scared? I hear it. No, it's a different song. Maybe it was just a fade out on that song. It sounded like it played twice. Uh, what am I doing getting in my ship? Yeah, I want to get in my ship. Right. Did we scan? We did scan. Obviously wasn't one here. Tell him you got called out on a job, Russ, and you're that dedicated, you decided to just do it using your own back and legs. But by the time you got there, you weren't needed anymore because it took you too long to get there. Right. I guess we're going to do this the old school way now. So, someone give me an... Oh, wait. Two star. Just to get going, someone give me a number between one and... No, not one. Between ten and twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So we'll check your one, even though it's a one star. So this is the way we used to do it. It's probably a lot harder for me now to search S classes. That that needs a crew to 
and do the whole S class slap plus the slot hunting. So we'll go back to old school for this stream. Alright, so, so now we know who to blame basically. So it's Affinity. If it's a rubbish ship, the chat blames you. What a plan. Oh, low atmosphere. Dissonance detected on it as well. What is the Sentinel? Forsaken. Dusty, volcanic, plated, radioactive. It's the unwritten rules, Divinity, I'm afraid. So, but if it's a good one, see, it works both ways. If it's. There's nothing here. I was going to say, if, if it's a good one, the credit goes to you in the chat. Now we jump to a two star. So you could be a hero too. For the cause. You got a three. Right. You know there's one here. Is his name Omkaka? Low atmosphere again. Intermittent sentinels. I might check that one out. Glacial, fungal, noxious, arched, aromatic. Right. Oshog. I'm sure I just saw one of our dudes had a name of like Kaka or something. Yeah, it's ca oh, Kakams. Kakams. Wow. Good name, mate. Good name, mate. I don't even know which my dummy ship is right now. <clears throat> Might have to be last night's one. Right, you know what to do here. Make it quick. This is the first one of the day, not a good start. But it's down to the chat as always. This is where we're gonna go. Do we hunt or do we next? If we hunt, we're looking for a better version, whether that's the S-Class or a high slot version. If you choose next, we go, we leave, we move on. Next system, next ship. Uh, Reacher next, Insani next, Russ next, AW next, Johnny next, Siphon next, uh, Hugh next, Marcus next. I have to see where that one's going. No need to count them ones up. So that one is a next. Uh, glyphs, let's get them up for you, like so. If you're interested, of course, just in case you're a shy lurker and you look at that thinking, <gasps> Dream Ship, then there you go. It's in Euclid, but we're off. Uh, good evening. Nice shade of orange. One of fifty. 
That is a book that I do have coming out soon, by the way. If you're interested. Fifty Shades of Orange. It's going to be a top shelf. Actually, no. Not top shelf. Wrong shelf. Top seller of a book. Right, so somebody give me a number between 6 and 16. Give me a number between 6 and 16. Oh, glyph screen, you're right. Doesn't matter, we're rolling that thing. You haven't missed anything, trust me. You haven't missed anything. 6 and 16. Yep, yeah, on a, oh, a 10 second delay. I'll wait for 1, 2, 3, 4. Right, now what we do, this is how we used to do it, just spin it around to the right on the spot and in the first dissonance system we see, we go to. Right there, I see it? One star again. Oh. It's done. Wasn't me. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I forgot to check out that planet, didn't I? Oh, what a shame it's warping me away from the one star. Right. So whose number was this, by the way? This was Will's, wasn't it? Oh, this is going to be an orange then. Three star. Ooh. Thought your eyesight had gone for good. Your eyesight, yeah, it's your eyesight. You've been drinking too much today, hmm? Hmm? Paradox. Dragon, that's white grass. Tropical, supercritical, scorched, the distance over there. Orange water though. Orange water. Probably means it's got an orange filter. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Out of there, I want to do that and check the fuel. 50% was still good for fuel. Run network disabled this evening, which means I get a better performance. First time I run a game in on a stream of network disabled in a long time. It'll be a much cleaner experience. go then so this is the ship now for you to choose what we do it's down to you in the chat if you want me to hunt for a better version of this potentially an s class but almost certainly the best slot version we can find then choose hunt 
you don't like this ship and you think no one else would like this ship, remember, you're not just voting for yourself. Ideally, when you're voting, you're also thinking, I don't like it, but someone else would. And then maybe you're voting for other travellers, not just yourself. Well, we'll see. Right, let's have a look. And, well, everyone's saying next. Oh, I didn't like you, mate. I didn't like you. So you said next on that one. The glyphs, let's bring them up. There they are. There are the glyphs. They're on fire now. Right. Got them? Good. Right. We move on then. Euclid Mayor as well for a Euclid this evening. So make sure I'm Euclid when you use those glyphs in the portal. So let's move on then. Uh, managed to get an S Class Sentinel ship thanks to one of your videos. Nice. Which one was it? I think there's 140 on the channel now. Quite a few. Right, someone in the number, in the number? Someone in the chat, give me a number. Between six and 16 again. Put a little bit of downward on it this time. Bit of decline here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we just spin it to the right until we find the first, there, there it was. Two star. Kagosaki, Kagosaki, Kagosaki. Yellow pincer or lifeless planet. This and an absent answer to none. Oh, brilliant. Oh, another abandoned. No atmospheric horror. Anyway. Uh, yeah, Yellow Pincer is the ship you're referring to. Oh, that's what. Oh, it's a jump. That's the ship. Oh, I've named Yellow Pincer. Very powerful ship is Yellow Pincer, and not just powerful, it looks amazing as well. Not my go-to colour scheme, but could have been worse, could have been orange, right? See if yellow pincers out. Still got it. Still, there we go. Yellow pincer, top damage, 144,000 DPS. She's a beauty. Oh god. Oh god. 
Oh god, let's make this really quick. Right, we have a... Oh, it's orange. Just, yeah. I'd, first five count. First five, first five votes. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Uh, Hunt or next. It's definitely orange. It's definitely ugly. Uh, <clears throat> based on the first five votes, let's go. One, next from AW. Uh, no, yeah, that's enough. There you go. Next. Right, the glyphs, if anybody wants these. There they are. Yada, 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 yada. It's in Euclid. It's ugly, but you might want it. Did that rock just get up and run away then? Did you see that? That was a big one as well. orange curse okay someone give me a number between 8 and 18 a number between what, uh, 8 and 18 how close oh look how we're all the way down the bottom there as well all the way down the bottom just realized 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 Seven, eight. Landed on one. Will it be one? This one's on UQ. Sue ya. It's got to be an American system, this one. So is this Scorps? Scorps, you'll do. Let's go, Scorps. Uh, good evening from Billa Shooter. Alright, so who gave me the number on this one? Q, right? Hopefully Q, you've broken the orange curse. Let's go. orange unfortunately but it's got pincers on the front I think hmm. let's see wow brilliant <laughs> I think it is orange Yep, we're looking at another orange. <clears throat> I mean, it could be a four square, but it's orange. What are you saying? Oh, it's, it's got a weird mouth on the front, isn't it? Like, ah. Say, ah. Hunt or next? What are we saying? Hunt or next? It is orange, white, and black. 
I mean, if there's any other colour, it might have been interesting to some. But, it's orange. Do you want orange? Will's already said next. Uh, Q said next. Insani said next. J said next. And then lots of other next come in. Bob Miller, Russ, Leslie, Linton, Pokemaster, all with a next. So it, I think that's safe next on that one. Uh, glyphs. Like so. In case you do like orange and you want to keep it a secret, remember, this is Euclid this evening. All right. Dude, where's my shit? Right, moving on then. Orange. Oh, that was close. Need to scrape the ship. Sorry, Captain. Victoria, aka Vicky, aka -A, Victor, was right. Okay, so someone give me a number between nine and seventeen. Go down just a little bit more. I like this level we're on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Quite a big void we're in right now. Oh, there we go, reaching out again now. They're miles away. Water, oh. I don't think anyone's going to be here, but it will walk us to one where there will be. Style over class. Slots over class. One star. Let's just check straight off the bat. As expected. What is here? Spined. We got a dead. Intermittent. Hmm. Cabled. Bladed. Rocky. Rattling. Let me just go and uh Yinny vet. I need to go have quick pictures of this, because I am still having a half eye open on the potential new shipping locations for Sundays. This my stream is the best chance I get at checking out system after system for a potential candidate. <clears throat> What's it called? Yinny something, right? Only a small one, wanna? Where was it? Is that you? No. Where are you? You hiding behind that one, are you, mate? That's not you over there, is it? I've got a feeling you're hiding. Was it called? Oh no. Nail. Naily C. Nally C. Nally C. Nally C. None of these are called Nally C, were they? Oh, that is it. There we go. A dead moon. It's tiny. God, it's well small. Uh, yes, blind shooter. There's a few on the channel. If you go to, hey, go away. If you go to the. Um... 25 S class video. No, there definitely is. The 25 S class video features the four square 
yellow pincer, which is also in the 35, the original video is in 35 Sentinel ship video. It's also in the 110 Sentinel ship video. And I also released a video about five days ago. It's a four square Sentinel ship. It's literally on the thumbnail it says best four square supercharged slot ship. I literally posted it a week ago. Another one. Who's in the living ship? It's trying to give me a quest. Right, anyway, I'm here to see this planet. Is there any raised platforms? That is the main thing we're looking for initially before we even land. And by the looks of it, none. No rings, nothing raised, not a good candidate, unfortunately. Size is irrelevant in this situation. But building is a no-go. Right, let's go. I've got both the four square ships in my hangar. referring to got this one which is Red Ripper this is the one in the video from last week this has got four squares together over on the left side in a square this is my fastest ship that goes 1131U that's what this one is and then you've got if it's not out, I'll just swap over here, I guess. Yellow Pincer, this one. This is also on the channel in about three different videos. End of the year video, the 25 S class video, and it's original video, which is 35 Sentinel ships. And this one has got four together on the right hand side. And this one uses my top damage ship, 144,000 DPS. So they're the two ones that are featured on my channel. There is a few more in Discord as well. Uh, one that Will Armstrong found a while ago, which never ended up getting put in a video. It's on my system still, in a folder. I think it was orange. <laughs> it's still a full square. Right. Let's move on. So, give me a number between 8 and 18. Uh, yes, they do, Blind Shooter. They do. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Oh, have to step back just a little bit, right in our range. Must have been doing some wide swing and there we go. Look at that though, perfect. <coughs> Toby Tiz. It's a shame, All right. Right, hold on. We're gonna have to. I can scan them, I guess. I just have to move forward to nab it if I see one. Right, that's the first one on the right. Oh my god, look at the name. Oren E. Uh, good evening. It's in a folder on my hard drive, just it's never got around to doing that viewer video for that collection backlog. I never say never. Sometimes the longer they're left, it's like a fine wine. Then viewers that watch my streams now might think they've seen everything, but then they'll pull out a video from ships that I found four or five months ago that they didn't see on a live stream. So it keeps the videos fresh at least. Let them mature.
Lovely weather. Beautiful weather. Welcome to Sove. Where your dreams are dashed. They literally are. It's a green Rizzler one, isn't it? I think. Is this yellow and green, this one? Whoa, matey. Jesus. Right. So, it's a, in my opinion, a very basic ugly ship. Now, if Green Rizzler's in the chat, would he enjoy it? Would he want it? But would he get outnumbered anyway? That was a close one, wasn't it? So, very simple green and yellow. Do we hunt for a better version or do we next? What class was this one? This was a B class. Hunt or next for this? Hunt or next? I mean, I don't even think Green Rizzler would take this. I just don't think there's enough to it. Regardless of the colour scheme, not very nice. Right. Uh, Jay next, Johnny next, Russ next, and Sunny Hunt, your man next, Mayor next, Cypher next, Fidel next. Uh, I think that's coming in quite. Josh next. Bombilla next, Will next. All right, I think that's clear to see. It, that one is a next on that one. Now the glyphs, there we go. If for any reason you did want it. Done, dusted, out of it. Right, let's move on. Hard or hardy working? We know the answer to that one, don't we? All right then, here we go. Goodbye, Arani. Give me a number between six and sixteen. A number between six and sixteen. Losing a lot of mileage here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. I haven't seen the results. I can't see the results till I end the stream and end the poll. What are the current results on the poll? Or not results, the current standings. Wow, half the poll, really? Well, saying that, say half the poll, the context would be how many people have actually voted. That could be two people voted.
Oh, where is our super ship tonight? Where is that? Oh yeah, ship. All we're getting is. Oh, I don't want that. I want some. So, it needs to step up its game, game. All right, I'll let you vote. Let's go. Red, salmon, pink. Uh, white. Is it X-Wing? No, it's not X-Wing. That is the final shape. Ugh. What are you saying? Hunt or next? You decide. Also, don't forget to like the stream. Do a man a favor. Do a man a favor. Like the stream. Right, there's the glyphs. I get a feeling I know where this is going. Remember, this is Euclid. We are in Euclid. Right. But beautiful as you are <coughs> it's the next do we need to land at sand like this and be like like I said oh, yeah! right none of that garbage behind us <laughs> get out of my face Sean Murray I feel insulted I think it was safe to say you all said next. I don't think there was a single hunt, was there? Oh, your yeah, man. Coming in hot there. It's Kiwis. GG, mate. Lucky, lucky, lucky. Although I didn't see how much you may have spent before that. All right, someone give me a number between 5 and 15. Let's go. I'm going to keep the downward decline going here. Yeah. See, we hit the bottom. We're right on the edge. May hit the bottom. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Leslie and Will both coming up with the same number. And we landed on a 1 star. Boiling doom sounds really nice here. What a shame it's taken us away from this one star system. Probably to another one star system. Poetog. Two star. Poetog. <laughs> blame Leslie. Well, we'll blame Leslie if it's bad, yeah? And then we'll also praise Leslie. It's good. Oh, we have a lifeless here. High security, never mind. Right, two star. What do you got for me? this, eh? More like this. Oh, 
Oh, this is a long off flight. I need an in-flight movie. Polo, entertain me. Good talk. It's like being in the crew all over again. Yellow and red, is it? Or yellow and orange? I think that's actually yellow and orange. Oh my god, even worse. Right. Yellow and orange. Hunt or next? Uh, down to you in the chat, though. Sorry, late to the party, but where's your friends? Don't they usually help or hunt with you? Uh, the crew hunting is still quite a relatively new thing. This is how it used to be. This is how it always bit was for at least six months. The way we're doing it tonight. The crew thing was just to involve the community more. If they want to get involved, be part of the hunt. Uh, no one was available this evening, but the hunt continues. Right, so Will says next, Johnny says next, uh, and Sunny says next, Russ next, but uh, yeah, it's all next. Look at that, we've got one hunt from Victoria. But Victoria, unfortunately, everyone else disagreed. There are the glyphs, just in case you want to check it out, Victoria. Just in case. Uh, next, I know. Bad times. Let's go. Nearly out of fuel on this one. Number between five and fifteen. Let's go, let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. one here though. One of these days I get a day off, I'll try my luck at hunting ships. You definitely should. It's addictive. That's the thing with hunting ships. There's always the next one. The next one could be the one. The next one could be the one. 
and sometimes it almost is. <clears throat> Luck. Chance. Right, here we go then. So the next one on today's agenda looks to be yellow. So, hunt or next. <clears throat> you decide whether you hunt or next. You're voting for yourself and your fellow hunters. Not everyone is represented in the chat right now. So if you look at a ship and you think, that's nice, but I wouldn't fly it, then consider hunt for your fellow traveller. Because whatever you select and whatever we hunt out the best of is what I document for the videos. So the chat controls the content that I put out to all the No Man's Sky viewers, not just the live stream viewers. So there's a lot of weight in your hands when you make the decision. Sometimes we've seen really nice ships get voted as the next, and it's a shame. It is a shame. So, the power of your vote counts for a lot. That definitely started this song again, didn't it? I'm just going to check something. One moment. I feel like that's playing the same songs over and over. Bear with me a second. Right, I think I'll fix that issue. <clears throat> Surprised no one's noticed already. Right. I've missed what we've... Right, six next, says Insani. Are you doing all the counting, Insani? Six next, nine hunt. Okay, so you have chosen hunt for this one. So this is the first hunt of the evening. Wow. Right. About what ships I picked up. Which one was that? Hopefully we can get a free one out of this one. If those middle two were static. Um, undamaged interceptor mod, I think it's called. Oh, this one might be a bugged one. It's very close to that data bank. We'll see. We'll see. <clears throat> if anyone likes roleplay, you can roleplay as a ship scrapper. And use my channel to get yourself a billion units. All them ships, all them coordinates, all them locations sat there waiting for people to just come along, pick them up, scrap them, and make millions and millions. Role play that. Farms, pff, ships.
Uh, the game hub many are asking if Snowfly is in a video. <clears throat> Right, <clears throat> snow. Oh, right, Snowfly. I'm just trying to think. Then, uh, Snowfly is in a video, but Snowfly is is uh, not white. There's a story to Snowfly. Snowfly is in one of my first ever videos. In fact, I think Snowfly was in the first video, No Man's Sky video got the ball rolling with the ship hunting and they'll call it flame fly it's this ship obviously but it was red and white and then I accidentally swapped it with another ship when I was ship hunting so I lost my OG flame fly and then someone else in fact quite a few people from the stream went back to that location and found me various flame flies that I'd originally hunted in S class, free ones, stuff like that. And I went back and got another one. But because it's not the original flame fly, as you can see I've named it 2.0 as well. I used a, a, a an editor, the save editor or colour editor, and I just turned it to white. And as white, this ship looks absolutely beautiful. But the ship itself is in a video, but it's called Flamefly. Well, that's what I called it, and it's red and white, not white and white. But yeah. Let's get back on this one so I don't swap the wrong ship. <clears throat> a few people have said that before, Anton, about me making a video about my current fleet. But the problem is, my current fleet is constantly changing. <laughs> and chance that by the time I release the video, that current fleet won't be my current fleet. You know what I mean? I mean maybe I can do my top six ships or something. The ones that are going nowhere type thing. This could be a free one. This could be a free one. There we go. Right, now the question is, it doesn't matter where that last one is. This is how we used to do it on this stream when it was just me. So now we found a free one. It is a sea... There's Diplos up there as well. They've got spikes. That's quite cool. I don't think I've seen them ones. Got like try spikes on the head. Anyway. Oh wow, look at that ring that's just appeared above my head. What the hell? What a strange formation. Anyway, do you want me to continue the hunt or settle? Now there is an emote in the chat that we haven't used in a long time because we've changed how we do things when there's a crew around. So there is an emote in the chat, which some of you old school ones know where it is and what it is. So do we continue the hunt for maybe a better, higher class free one? I'm not saying we're gonna get it. Or do we settle? Are right, you happy to settle for the C class? Free one on this one. Right. So now, because obviously I'm on my own, what we do, reload the restore point, because so I've now obviously taken that ship, and I want to be able to show the slots before and after in the video. Take a long time to load, doesn't it? Right, so it's a C31, so now we can put the ball down. C3 plus 1, TGH. Right. Just 
phone now is. And this is Euclid. Right in the corner. Right, let's get the slots now after. Fire! In flight stuff. Oh, wait, what? Wrong one. Done. Right. <clears throat> now, I'm going to ask in advance before today's break if anybody in the chat, to give you all plenty of time and a heads up, 
be able to get to a, a portal in time. Does anybody in the chat want or need any ship hunting items themselves? Are you someone that has tried ship hunting, would like to try ship hunting, doesn't know where to start, doesn't know what items you need, or even knows what items you do need, but just needs some so you can duplicate more and like uh, get stuck in yourself? So if you're someone that wants anything that you see me used on stream today, the AI fragments to hunt these bad boys down, the class fragments for memory, which means upgrading your, uh, so the memory fragments for class to upgrade the class of the ship's planet side, if it doesn't cost you nanites, or the class fragments to upgrade your inventory, memory fragments, sorry, that upgrade your inventory slots for free. If you need any of those items in a stack of 10, you can get some off of myself or another member slash mod when I have my break. There'll be like a player meet while I'm on my break. So if you're someone that is up for or wants any of these items, then I suggest in the next sort of 10 minutes, get yourself to a portal in Euclid. And then once I get to the location, I'll put the details on the screen. You can jump straight there head to location and get yourself some free goodies. We do this every stream, however. One second. Ooh. Finger slipped. I do this every stream, however. Some people get there a little bit late because it's sort of announced a bit late. So the items in question would be a stack. You can have a stack of these items. You can have a stack of all of them if you wanted to. The carrier AI fragments is what I use when I land in a dissonance system, as you've seen. And then when I pop one of these, dissonance spike detected. And then it's going to take me direct to a ship, as you've seen. So having these and then duplicating stacks of 10 means you can just hunt sentinel ships to your heart's content. These are the memory fragments for class. So when I land at a C class and I collect the ship, I can just pop a couple of these to level up to an S class and see what the slots are before all I've even flown away. And if it's rubbish, you can even reload the save and then get them all back. But if you duplicate them, you don't need to do that rubbish. You just keep going and keep going. And then these ones are to unlock any empty slots in ships like this. So sometimes the slots are there but behind a hidden slot not hidden but like a slot that's not been unlocked so having all those items planet side makes for much faster ship hunting much faster ship hunting In if you're a lurker, as long as you, once you arrive, you let us know in the stream chat or even the game chat. Just let us know what you want and we'll sort you out. Now, just, to, uh, just out of curiosity, at the start of the stream, I did say, uh, set a little challenge to see if there's any artists in the chat. There was three people that said they were up for it. Just curious if those three people are still in the chat. And if so, did you begin work on any kind of artistic creation for us to come and have a look at later? Brockton, do not disturb me. Ooh, go on, Brockton. So Brockton looks like he's up for it, and we're definitely going to go and check that out at the end of the stream. He's creative R. 
Stormin says yes, kind of. So there's two of them. Who's the third one? I'm trying to remember who the third one was. Uh, was it Martin, was it? Someone else said, oh, I'm not much of an artist, but I'll try. Who said that? Right. So that looks like a light blue slash purple, but I think that's just the filter, right? Either way, this is what we're looking at for this ship. Purple slash purple. Maybe purple slash blue. Very simple style. Does have the nice wings though. Rather than the whole shape. It does have that cutout, which I like. Mandibles. Not a big fan of mandibles, but it does have this section here at the front which stops these skinny fronts looking boring. So overall, for its style, it's not a bad looking ship, but what are you gonna say in the chat? Is this gonna be a hunt? Or is this going to be the next? Now you can't get him anymore, uh, Alejandro. They were from an expedition. That's why I like to hand them out, and other members of the community like to hand them out. Keep them going within the economy of the game. Keeping the ship hunters alive and going. It's all down to you in the chat whether we hunt or we next. And if we hunt, we're looking for a good slot version and or the S-Class version. It's all up to you. You're the ones that vote. You make the decisions on if we hunt or if we leave and next. Marcus Chill. No art here. Are you trying though, Marcus? Are you building something? You might think it's art right now, but it could turn into the greatest piece of art ever seen on No Man's Sky. If you build it, they will come. Uh, Russ was a next. Sorry, a hunt. Your man was a next. Uh, Jay was a hunt and Sunny was a hunt. Uh, Stephen, that thing is kind of wicked. Uh, Tommaso says hunt. Bombilla says hunt. Blind says hunt. Ziki says next. Victoria hunt. Uh, Johnny says hunt. Uh, Josh is a hunt. Insani says it's a hunt. Cypher, 10 hunt. Well, there you go. You could become a terrain editing master now, Marcus Chill. There's still a good 40 minutes left. I said half 12. I'll check them. So what I'll do is I'll time it. So once I come back from a break. Uh, actually, that might be too early after my break. That's still 40 minutes away. I said half 12, then I gave you two hours. If people are still building and they want extra time, maybe I'll stretch it till one, quarter to one. But half 12 at the moment is the designated time. We'll come and check out your artwork. Right, so it always is a hunt, this one. So let me get down the dummy ship, which was, which was this one. Anywhere, land. Right, not looking good for the B class, having two split apart right from the word go. Normally the C class, it turns out to be the bangers. They're the sleepers normally, the C-classes. There we go, rubbish. Right.
two on one, I think. Oh, no, wait. See, I told you, C classes, normally the sleepers. Sli uh, C classes, most people turn their noses up, but once you've upgraded them to West class, they're the bangers. Right, so, uh, free one. <clears throat> you know the score. So we'll continue the hunt. Or should we settle with the C class 3 1? Up to you in the chat. Continue the hunt. Or settle. While you're deciding, I'm going to reload the restore point. Preemptively. Sani, Josh, Jay, Johnny, Victoria, Ross, or Sang Cell. <laughs> right. Did that just load the wrong save? What the hell? Ah, uh, they just love when it does this. That is my ship now, apparently. What happened there, then? Did I get in and out of it? I must have done. Alright. I'll have to take the C-Class moment from stream. It's a screenshot. So... Uh, that's so annoying when it does that. Right, so I can record and a note to self. This was a C class, not an S class. C class, not an S class. I'm an old man. I remember that now when I watch the video. I'll be like, ah, oh. rather than just dumping an S class video and look an idiot. Oh, that's a nice side of shit. Right, glyphs on this one. There we are. Remember, if you are interested in this one yourself and you want to pick up this free one, super charge slot, uh, super charge slot version, it's in Euclid. All right, now, recording. Again, note to self, take a screenshot from the stream of C-Class. I can't believe I've done that. Right. Editor, add in Todd Howard. Thank you.
<laughs> it just works, Stephen. It just works. Looking mean, son. Looking mean. Right, last one. Dum 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 dum. Uh, that's not very straight of you, is it? Right. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Not too close. My son is five, and he loves No Man's Sky. Unfortunately for him at the moment, he's only getting to play on my old Xbox One, but he's five. Even though it's 15 FPS, he appreciates it. He loves it. He even done his own stream. He done his own shit meat stream on New Year's Eve. He loves it. Absolutely loves it. So, No Man's Sky, 100% is a game for all ages. 5.95 It doesn't matter The game loves you all Right Who wants some freebies? My older boy don't even play games no more He's a bus driver now Meh Right, where should we meet? I'll go to X me on the off chance that there is someone that wants items. It's easier to me to X me. So if you are someone that wants to come and grab items from me, now is the time to do it. So now I'm going to go on a quick break, coffee break, stretch my legs before we continue the rest of the stream. So now I'll part the details of the location where I'm going to be. There may well be a mod here, that, or other members of the community. Uh, if no one has got the items you need, I'll give them to you personally once I get back from my break. So you have 10 minutes to get your butts here. The place is called x -Me. It's one of our old ship meet areas, and we still use it now, or I still use it, as a player meet location. So, details. Bottom of the screen, I've removed the black bar. Bottom left of your screen. In fact, network enabled. Let's do that. There we are. Now, once someone arrives in the system where I am, the game will unpause. So feel free to join me if you want to come and hang out. If you need items, let the chat know 
let me know in game when I get back and I'll sort you out. So, if you're sticking around, I'll see you in 10 minutes. If you're not, thanks for watching this much. I hope you liked the stream. I hope you enjoyed it. But to those that are staying, I'll see you in 10 minutes. Sound good? Oh, yeah!
Right, I'm back. I put zero to one because technically I don't have the game yet. <coughs> fair, fair. I was just curious, the kind of uh, experience length of people these days. Because this game just continues to sell. Especially when they put it on sale so much. Which is always good. It's always good to see the player base grow and evolve. Tastes change, styles. People bring in new stuff to the game. Right. <coughs> Excuse me. Is anybody here at location awaiting items? <coughs> Excuse me. I started when they revisited those expeditions a few months ago. What, the Christmas ones, you mean? When they've done like this, was it four of them? I can't remember. Maybe been four. Right, so no one is here, I assume. Those that are here were just visitors or being sorted out. Who do we have? Who do we even have here? Let's have a quick butchers who's actually here. Uh, Anton, Wilma, uh, Jay Reacher, and Far Sights. Are you all good for items then? Everybody that's here. Far Sights is saying not right now. He's good. Wilma is always good, I believe. Wilma, you good? My ship, by the way. Is it Sunday? I'm good. Was me to Anton. No worries. No worries. Will is good. Where's the time? Hmm. Almost time to go and check on our artists. If our artist is still there. Ten minutes. Ten minutes. Tick tock, tick tock. Who is that that's set over there? Anton, that was Anton. still be here in six years. Uh, some form of it will be. My son's already in training. He's a little gamer already. He keeps saying he wants to be a YouTuber. I was like, good luck with that, mate. <laughs> but we're gonna, I'm going to start his own little channel for him when he's six just for shorts of the stuff he creates on Minecraft because he's got such an imagination. So it won't be him as such in videos, but just his little creations. He's already got his little Xbox name, which he wanted to call himself. He chose it and he's called Callum's Game Hub. Hopefully, we'll follow in my footsteps. We'll see. Have you finished Brockton? In fact, the three people that were building on LA Meat, how many of you are ready for inspection of art? Did Chris make it? Chris? Someone called Chris on their way? Uh, there's no Chris here. The autophage missions, nice. Good armor. And staff, I'm using the autophage staff as you can see. 
over the new staff. I mean, the new staff is nice, don't get me wrong, but... Did I even keep it? I did. Nice staff. But nah. I like my one. Where is it? Red Skull. Is it Red Skull? I've got to check. Uh, can't find it, no worries. Can't find what? The actual base or the system? Have you got network switched on, yeah? Right then. So. <clears throat> should we go and have a look at our artists? See what they've made. At the start of the stream, I asked everybody in the stream, the early birds, if anyone wanted to be up for a little challenge. And that was to create some form of artwork before the stream ended. Now, the question is, how many of the people that said they were going to do it built something? Now, trying to see if I can see any base computers or players appear, so I'll give it a moment. I'm assuming anyone that's here has got your network on. Yeah. Oh, there we go. I just had a stutter, so does that mean someone has just entered the network? There we go. So we've got Old Guy Drift. There we go. Do you remember I said Old Guy Drifter? Would be the sort of person that would be good at this. I also said that. One of our lurkers. I wonder if he's built something here. Ooh, I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. So what we're going to do, it's all a bit of fun. I'm going to kind of go and have a look to see what these four people have done. It's just a bit of fun to see if someone can create a bit of art. And then in the chat, you will decide, or you can decide. Is it art or not art? So we've got four people here. Now, I'm hoping to see... All right, who's over here? Old Guy Drifter. I can see Old Guy Drifter. I can see more base computers over. No, <laughs> no Banksy. Sentinel, Hun Sentinel Hunter Chill. So I can see three. Who's the fourth? Yeah, I'm going to save Old Guy Drifter to last. Old Guy Drifter. <sighs> can you put something in the chat in the game to acknowledge that you're listening to me now? You don't have to like respond. You can just literally put like a a a a a. And are you going to be there for a good sort of 10, 20 minutes so I can come to you last? Can you confirm that somehow for me in the game chat or stream chat? Some way, so I know I'd leave you till last because you haven't got a base computer there, or have you? Yes, he does. Hmm. See two bases over here. Where's the fourth? Is there actually four of you that have done this? I want to see all of yours. He's not responded anyway. And he's not even in the game chat, so. Hmm. Right. I'll take a gamble. I won't see your safe beacon. I might see your combo, but if not, put a base computer down. You can delete it afterwards if you want. It's just as a good indicator for me to find you. So we know old guy drift is over there. We definitely know he's in. We've got two over here together. I can see two player icons. Wait, what? That's old guy, right? Oh no, wait, oh, just flew straight past them. So we've got two together over here. So Storm and Echo and Chill. So these are two, so where's Brockton? I'll find you next, Brockton. Let's start here. 
Right. Now, it might take a few seconds to load in as it's terrain edits, I'm guessing, for most of these. Uh, what's up, uh, Bill? Uh, Franklin? Right, I'll go backwards to start with. Not backwards, but the camera backwards. I just want to allow whatever's here to load in. I was stand near him. There we go. So, good evening. Sentinel Hunter Chill. How long do you reckon it needs? see parts floating so I'm guessing I'm not seeing it all as of yet <clears throat> or is it supposed to be like this am I seeing stuff missing right now I don't want to go too much and look, look too much up or look. Mm. I'm getting a feeling I'm not seeing what I'm supposed to be seeing. Is it supposed to be a hand? No. You've uploaded it, yeah? Ten percent showing. Hmm. Oh, kind of glitched in then, sort of. Very weird. Oh, this is a shame if the terrain nets are not going to show. I'll come back and try in a minute, see if anything changes. Do another upload of what you see, and I'll come back and check it again. We're all on the same planet, I ain't got to like, do any effort. Right, there's another one close by, right? Just storming. Let's see if. Here's one loads. A small one, right? A small one. I'm going backwards again. Ah. Uh. Probably makes no difference whatsoever, but if your sentinel's out, like dismiss it, probably makes no difference, but I know it can affect some things like ships and stuff. Just on the off chance. Uh, I'm guessing this is the set. Is, have you got terrain edits here? I'm guessing there is supposed to be something here. Right? just works.
most of what you see is on ground of some kind. Yeah, that's why I... Hmm. It's not even like it's busy here. When Milo done the terrain edits on his ship meet base, once everyone was there, just for a few minutes, we saw the changes. So I wonder why this has been so slow. What a disappointment, eh? These boys have gone to effort to make stuff, and it ain't even showing. What's wrong with your game, eh? Come on, Mr. Murray. What a disappointment. Exactly, so little parts. That's what I mean. This is why I thought it would be like a nice, easy, quick challenge. Just about creating something arty. <clears throat> but nope. The game says nah. Right. I'll come back to it in a second then. See if old guy Drifter shows. And I still can't see nothing for Brockton, by the way. Wherever Brockton may be. I'm wondering if you might have to wait 24 hours. Even for the terrain edits to upload. The thing is, I can see your base parts. But that may be because you're online. But then... Surely terrain edits would be the same. I mean, I can see markings of where you've been working. You can see the indentations on the ground. Disable network. Mm. Oh, I'll tell you what I could try. Someone suggested this before. I don't think it'll make any difference, but... Let's try something. Where's your base computer? Oh, I'll tell you what you could try. Last ditch attempt. Give me... Or make the base edit. So, you, have you got me as a friend on there? Or just make it, like, base edits open for a moment. Just to see if once I've got edits on your base, I see whatever it is you've done. Maybe. I don't know. Give me edit. Well, the area's got edits now. Oh god, they're noisy. Sounds like something's about to explode. Nope, that doesn't seem to have made any difference either. Maybe it needs 24 hours. Like a regular full upload. Let's go and check. Maybe this is something I can check again at the start of tomorrow's stream to see if a full 24 hours, or almost a full 24 hours, has made a difference. Let's go and see. Old guy and see what he's built over here. Yeah, and also take screenshots and post them in Discord. So, <clears throat> take a screenshot of what you've actually done. And then we can, uh, I can double check tomorrow so we can actually see it in, in person. And to see if that, it's all about science, isn't it? 
This is just a on the spot thing I thought I'd see if anyone's up for trying this evening. Give the end of the stream something different. Share some of your creativity. Like, have you ever seen those 60 minute makeover? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Is that loading? There's like a frog with a walking stick. I can see something. Or I'm going to see it all as another matter. I guess I'm not seeing it all because he's definitely standing. Unless he's in photo mode, I don't know. I've got no way of knowing because he's not going to speak on the stream. Uh... I don't know if, we've, if we're not seeing everything. I mean, there could be something behind it that we're just not seeing. Oh, there we go. See? See? We're not seeing it all. Definitely not seeing it all. Come on, old guy. Manifest it. Manifest it. Oh, here we go. Here we go. coming in well that's what he was standing on I love the fact Four of you took up the challenge. And I hope we can get to see the other three as well. Maybe the others will work now as well. I just wish there was some way that I could confirm with old guy whether I'm seeing everything or if there's still big parts missing. We'll get a close up of the uh, old guy with the stick in a second. That's what it is. Is that like a staff he's holding? The new one. I'm guessing there's still terrain missing. I'm guessing there's still terrain missing. I'm not seeing the full terrain edit. We've probably seen all of the um, parts that he's added, but not the full terrain edit. We've got no way of knowing. No way of knowing. Wait, there is a way of knowing. Old Guy Drifter. If you're listening to the stream, if I am seeing everything, put down a red one of these things just there. Oh, sorry, green one. If I'm seeing everything, put a green one down. If there's missing stuff, put a red one down. Just down here. Just one. Green one if I'm seeing everything. Red one if we're not seeing the full terrain edit green one so we are seeing everything this is it all right so this wait so green you're saying that is all of it yeah all right valiant effort I know it's not easy using that manipulator. It's not easy. 
So, chat, is this art or is it not art? Right, Cypher, Art, Storming, Art, Marcus, Art, Josh, Art. Let's get a bit of sunlight on his face now. We've we'll seen the back. Uh, <clears throat> Q, Art, your man, Art, J, Art, Fry, Art, Tommaso, Art, Insani, Art, Franklin, Art, Linus, Art, Anton, Art, Old Guy Drifter. I think they declared this art. This has to stay here now. If anyone wants to come and see this first hand, details are bottom of the screen. The place is called LA Meat. If you want to put a piece of art on this planet, obviously not on top of somebody else's, feel free and then take a screenshot and put it in our Discord. Planet of Art. And hopefully we get to see them all. But either way, this was Old Guy Drifter. He'd done it in about 90 minutes, if that. Challenge was set randomly at the start of the stream. Who can create a piece of art? And this was his entry. So far, the other two have not been shown, unfortunately. Which is a shame. Right. Should we go and see if we can see the other two? Well done, mate. Thank you for having a crack. Taking part. Right, was Brockton's close? What's this one over here? Brockton. Uh, if you want to join our Discord, or share any of your art, exclamation mark Discord in the chat. I'm seeing a Diplo here. Four men. <clears throat> I wonder if the other two might work now. This one appears to be loading in, but we'll see, we'll see. Oh, a lot still four men, so I'll just wait a moment. Still loading in. Oh, what's happening? Oh, oh. What's cracker lacking? Is it unforming? Come on, game. Sort yourself out. It's trying. I can feel the game's trying. Every now and again, there's like a tug. But then it feels like it's putting old terrain back. Alright, let's go into camera mode. In fact, I'm miles away. It feels like I'm close, but I'm not. So maybe we go right on top of it somewhere. Like so. Oh. 
Hopefully it'll all load in, whatever's loading in as we're looking. Yeah, there's a lot seem to be loading back in that shouldn't be loading back in. You can see that. What is the game doing right now? You make your mind up game, you're going to load it in. Is it where are all the chunky bits off the side now? Now, Brockton, um, I can see it's still changing. Like, is there anything specific that's obviously I've already not seen your final form, but is there anything specific that's not loaded in at all? Yeah, like, keep trying to chuck the old terrain back in. Again, this might be something I'll have to properly look at tomorrow after a full 24 hours of your base uploaded. But you can see where you're going with it. It's massive, mate. Like, I mean, it's massive. Look, I'm up here. Look how small I am. Look. This thing's massive. Oh. Look, it's now just starting to go invisible in some parts. Uh, hey game. I think this part of the game's gone on a break. It's a good feature though, we can see inside, look. It's not just showing, even briefly, it's full shape. Oh, the invisible part's no longer invisible at the back, though. Oh, that is so big. That's crazy big. We're going to see the other twos are loaded in now. Definitely worth uh, coming back and checking at another point though, just to have a look to see if it all settled. You can see how big it is. Look, that's just stupidly big. Not stupidly big, but you know, just crazy big. Old guy drifter dude. He's the hunter. This is what he's hunting. Out on these great big lands. Right, so you see the other two are showing now. Right, where over there they storming over here.
Hmm. I'm seeing less than I did before. How does that work? I feel like I could probably just land it on top of something. Hmm. How weird. I swear last time there was raised platforms at the rear of this. Oh, game. There's always got to be one kill joint in there. It's, this time it's the game. Oh, we got this bit. Right, so. I mean, personally, I would say that this piece of rock right here, mate, is art. I mean... Be whatever you want it to be, really, can't it? Oh, 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 maybe that's the trick. I'll just stand here and not look. So, look, we talk about this piece of rock. <clears throat> yeah, so this rock's the art. And this one would sell for millions. Actually, gonna load. Come on, game, you know you want to. If you try the camera. Oh, 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 come on, game, come on, game. You can do it, game. We have faith. Sort of. Todd Howard has faith. Still loading. Come on, you know you want it. You know you want it. I think the bigger the terrain edit, the longer it's going to take for it to fully upload and kind of propagate on all the server type things. I think tomorrow this would probably load in. I think I need to revisit this tomorrow. In fact, what I'll do before I start the stream tomorrow, because obviously this is my base computer here anyway, I can just come back and take a peek and see if they've actually loaded. I mean, Old Guy Drifter was minimal base terrain, wasn't it? So I guess that's why it loaded in okay. But I mean, <clears throat> Brockton's was massive. I'm surprised whatever you've built here hasn't loaded the terrain. I think tomorrow it will. But definitely all four of you post screenshots in Discord of what you've done. So then when I come back before the stream tomorrow, I can have a look at the screenshots and see if what I'm seeing is what it's supposed to be. And if it is, I can start the stream here before I start. You know what I mean? So we can have a quick glance at them before we start the ship hunting. <coughs> so your efforts were not in vain. If you want to check out their builds, what they're supposed to look like, hopefully all four of them will post them in Discord. Just post it in the No Man's Sky screenshot area. So exclamation mark discord in the stream chat or any uh, video description and sometimes it's the pinned comment. That's where you can find the discord link 
exclamation mark discord while you're in a live stream if you want to join our discord for any reason ship sharing for help chit chat or check out whatever they've built Right. This is not our ship, is it? Oh, that's Stormy's ship. Oh, is that yellow pincer? Right. No more is loaded in right now, is it? No, it's still the same. Right. I am going to call it there for the evening. Now, I do have a Helldivers stream scheduled for half one, but that may not go ahead um, I'll decide in the next sort of 15-20 minutes so if anyone is planning on joining me on the Helldiver stream um, bear in mind it may not happen, we'll see um, but thanks to everyone this evening, thanks to the four people that took part in the little challenge and I look forward to seeing the screenshots of how you're seeing it in Discord, I'll check that after the stream or even tomorrow morning if you need time to post a screenshot. So thanks for everyone this evening. Thanks for everyone that's liked, subscribed. Thanks to your... What's that? Loot box. Oh. Yeah, thanks to your efforts for here this evening. I appreciate that. Last minute, sort of, four. I look forward to seeing the screenshots. So... Until the next stream, I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching.